Hold on to your pants because this week is a big week for releasing magic. We answer all your questions in question time and we find out who the winners are in this week's giveaway. Roll that intro. G'day champion, welcome back to Murphy's Magic What's New this week. It's me, your host, E. Katarina. How are you? I hope you're having an incredible Wednesday so far and you're ready to dive into some new magic because it is huge and it's gonna be a big week. So let's dive straight in. So first things first is question time. This first question comes in from Brendan Pierce over there on YouTube where he asks about Lloyd's and Javier's decks. Now I literally just spoke to Lloyd and it's looking like December or January release. As soon as we know more, we'll let you know, Brendan, I promise. This next question comes in from Magic Stuff 13 over there on Instagram. Hello there. Enough said. This last question comes in from Jack Gat over there on YouTube where he asks whether Ned Kelly is a crook or a hero. Hmm, that's a good question. But in the terms of Australian slang, crook actually means you're sick. So if you were out and you're gonna chuck a sickie on a, on a work day or a school day, you would say, I'm feeling a bit crook today. But that is a good question, Jack. Is Ned Kelly a hero or a criminal? Let me know what you think in the comment section below. For he is the world's premier outlaw illusionist. <laughs> and so, Ned defeated Sinclair once and for all and rode away as the world's premier outlaw illusionist. Now that was a very short question time this week. If you've got any questions about anything at all, please leave them in the comment section below. Use the hashtag question time so I can find them amongst all the competition entries. This part of the program is brought to you by Sucker Punch. They're just like poker chips, but way cooler. Now let's see what was released in this last week in Magic. On Friday, Jim Steinmeier and Vortex Magic released into the world Not Unexpected. Now Jim is considered one of the most creative thinkers in Magic and Not Unexpected shows why this is. After Doug Henning's performance of The Moving Knot on his television special, he reached out to Jim to come up with a method that was more practical for his touring show. Jim created Not Unexpected, one of the most practical and deceiving versions of the cut and restored rope. Vortex Magic has spent over two years designing and having prototypes made to get the perfect knife for this illusion. You can now perform the moving knot and cut and restored rope with confidence and ease using any piece of rope. Now this does come with a special knife and download tutorial, but also the knife is very sharp, so please be careful. If you wanna see more on Not Unexpected, link in the description below right now where you can pick it up for $79.95. You need a skill level of a beginner magician to do it. Or again, the trailer is available just up here. On Monday, Matthew Wright brought us the e-wallet. Now the e-wallet is an everyday wallet for every occasion. It's the world's first modular wallet, meaning that you can take it anywhere and take away different elements from the wallet depending on your situation. A small, slim credit card style wallet is the starting point. This can be used as a peak wallet or a no palm card to wallet that appears inside an envelope. It's small, slim design means that it can be used anytime, anywhere. Next, we have a larger back pocket or jacket pocket style card to wallet. The size has been designed to ensure quick and easy loading of a palm card into a jeans back pocket or in the inside pocket of a more formal jacket. The slim smaller wallet can be inserted into the larger style wallet, instantly making this a Malika style loading no palm card to wallet. Combining the two wallets together opens up the possibilities for double card effects never before possible. Finally, a peak window can be inserted into the large wallet. This opens up the use for the wallet even further. The wallet is available in black or brown and is made from high quality leather. With routines including anniversary wallet, which is the anniversary waltz like no other, card monte, the classic in the hand two card switch with the kicker ending, and card under wallet, card under box on another level. Multiple card under wallet, which is four different cards, two under the wallet, two inside, which is two separate wallets, plus five other stunning routines also including bonus downloads of the best-selling effects from Matthew Wright. In total, that's almost nine hours of teaching. So if you wanna see more on the e-wallet, link in the description below right now where you can pick it up for $125. You need a skill level of an intermediate magician to do it, or you can see the trailer just up here. Then on Tuesday, Julio Montoro bought us Creative Weekly Volume 1. Now in 2020, Julio Montoro decided to release a new monthly subscription in Spain to share his creations with all his Spanish followers. It was just a one-year project, but it was a total success with almost 900 Spanish magicians joining the subscription, learning 52 effects that Julio created just for them. Now in 2022, Julio has decided to share the project with his international friends in a really exclusive way. Only 400 units will be printed every single month during one year. This means that only 400 magicians around the globe will actually be able to know how Julio's mind really works. This is what you're gonna get in volume one. A post-it restoration, instant polo, sticky bill, and wow post-it. 
All of these effects are available for $19.95, which is $5 per effect. You need a skill level of a beginner magician to do it. But if you want to see a full breakdown of what you're going to get in Creative Weekly, check out my full breakdown available just up here. That's right, it is now time for the news. Now on Saturday's Saturday Sorcery, I taught you a free Halloween effect. So you learned a haunted deck and a haunted tuck is really visual and incredibly easy to make. If you want to learn how to do this, link just up here where you can learn it for free. Then carrying on with the Halloween theme on Sunday, Javier treated us to a full performance of The Mummy. If you want to check it out in its entirety, it is available just up here. Now it's time for this guy's favorite part of the episode, Meme of the Week. Well, this absolute work of art comes from Dronak over there on our Discord, and boy, oh boy, does it hit too close to home. Thanks so much for sharing that, my friend. If you want to see your meme shared on what's new this week, all you need to do is head over to our magic meme section, link in the description below to our Discord, share it there, or take a look and put it in a future week's episode. Now it's time to jump over to our artist for our artist shout out, Sonia Benito, and a performance of Waken. Take it away, Sonia. Magic is so amazing. It gives you the opportunity to experience something beautifully unusual. You bring We'll try to make sense of it, solve it. Nah, that's stress, no, that's madness. No, 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 that's reverse. Watch. However, there are things in life that you can't even explain or solve. And you know what? That's completely okay. Whoa, ho, ho, ho. what a spookily awesome performance. Thank you so much, Sonia, for sharing that. I really do appreciate it. If you want to see more of Sonia's work, link in the description below right now to her Instagram, where you can check out all of her incredible performances. If you want your performances shared on Murphy's Magic What's New this week, all you need to do is tag us in your post. I'll take a look and put it in a future week's episode. It really is that easy. It's time to check out a new reviewer on the streets, Khan and his review of Maxim. Over to you, mate. Hi guys, my name is Khan and welcome to another incredible review that I'm pretty sure you will love. It is going to be about the brand new magic app called Maxim by Lloyd Barnes and Murphy's Magic. If you like what you see, make sure to check it out at tripomagic.com. The link, as always, is in the description box below. But that's been said, let's jump straight into the review. What an incredible review, Khan. Thank you so much. If Khan looks familiar, you might know him from his release, Alibi. If you want to see the full review by Khan, link in the description below right now. We can check it out on his YouTube. Now it's time for our random comment entry winner. So if you're from Instagram, YouTube, or Facebook, congratulations, my friends. You want this week's secret prize. Make sure you email me just here and I'll get those prizes out to you quicker than you can count to the number one. If you want to enter into next week's secret competition, all you need to do is comment anything you want below. I'll choose someone out at random and you'll be announced in next week's video. So good luck. It's now time for this week's deck of the week, where this week we're looking at the 1000 Cranes V3 playing cards by Riffle Shuffle. The 1000 Cranes is one of Riffle Shuffle's most fun designs, with the back featuring two classic origami cranes on top of an intricate 3D structure-like design to give you a deck that's fun to look at. The 1000 Cranes V3 keeps the original design of its predecessor while embodying a vibrant yellow on the back with its two snowy white cranes that are symmetrical to each other. When you place three decks together, it'll showcase with an enlarged image of the origami crane across its type cases. The 1000 Cranes V3 playing cards are printed by United States Playing Card Company on their crushed B stock and is limited to only 2,500 decks. If you want to see more on the 1000 Cranes V3 playing cards by Riffle Shuffle, link in the description below right now, where you can pick them up for just $10. It's now time for the back in stock section. Kicking off this week's back in stock items is Yigel Masika's Tarantula 2. When Yigel's groundbreaking tarantula was first introduced, magicians called it the most incredible levitation device of all time. Now, after seven years of re-engineering and refinements, it's back and better than ever. If you want to see more on the Tarantula 2, link in the description below right now where you can pick it up for just $75. But that's not the only you go item back in stock. We also have the Spider Pen X, Masika Wax, Masika Elastics, Inner Circle, Electric Touch Plus, Loops Volume 1 and 2, and Loops New Generation. Next up, we have three new Tenu items back in stock. First up is Lucky Strings 2023. This is a baffling game that your spectators simply can't win. Five strings extend from an envelope but only one string is attached to the winning bell at the bottom. Allow your spectator to choose one of the four strings and the final string remains for you. Pull each of the selected strings upward and show that they are all loose strings. None of them is attached to the winning bell. The single string that they left for you is the winner. Every selection is freely made by the spectator, even if they decide to change strings midway. 
they still cannot find the winning string. Everyone is fascinated by the concept of destiny, and that is clearly the theme in this baffling magic trick. If you want to see more on Lucky Strings 2023, the link in the description below right now, we can pick it up for $14.95, and there is no skill level required. Next up in the 10 year items is the final piece. This is a professional level effect performed by top pros. A spectator randomly selects a jigsaw puzzle piece from a loose pile of pieces. The magician draws attention to a cloth that covers a completed puzzle on the table. He removes the cloth and shows that there is one piece of the puzzle still missing. Incredibly, the single puzzle piece that the spectator selected is the exact correct piece needed to complete the puzzle. This famous effect has been performed by many top professional magicians. This easy method brings the identical effect within your grasp, so you can delight and baffle your own audiences. If you want to see more on the final piece, link in the description below right now, we can pick it up for just $24.95. Last up in the 10 year old items is Size Surprise. This is easy to do card magic with maximum impact. Show the ace through five of clubs in your hand and ask which one of these is the biggest cards. The spectator will naturally answer the five. Suddenly the cards all change in size. The five becomes a tiny card. The ace expands to a jumbo size. This easy to do masterpiece of card magic is sure to astound your audiences and leave them rubbing their eyes. If you want to see more on Size Surprise, link in the description below right now, we can pick it up for just $19.95. It's now time to check out some downloads that you don't want to miss. This first download is last week's vault, Ambition Ink by Ding Ding. The ink from a face up playing card rising up through the deck. An ambitious routine that is completely different from any other ambitious routine you've ever performed. It's fun to make, easy to perform, and an impossible visual moment that your spectators will never forget. If you want to see more on Ambitious Ink, link in the description below right now where you can pick it up for just $10. This next download is Pips Gone by Timmy Master. This is where pips and numbers on a playing card vanish in the blink of an eye. There's no magnets, no black art, visual and elegant, easy to do and practical, perform at any time and anywhere. So what are you waiting for? If you want to see more on Pips Gone, link in the description below right now where you can pick it up for just $8. This last one is a special announcement that the Finish magazine is now available at your favorite magic shop in download format. You can pick these up for as little as $2.99 if you want to link to the Finish magazine right now, link in the description below. G'day champion, welcome back to Murphy's Magic Game Show. It's me, your host, Grizzly Peterson. Let's jump in and see what the prices are for this week. <laughs> All those prizes for just one of you. What an absolute treat. That's tasted in a sausage roll out by the billabong. Now let's see who won tonight's prize. What do we do? Oh, the old drover hat tip. That'll do it. There you go. Who's gonna win? Hey, is it gonna be you? Oh, close. What are you? Oh, no, sorry. Hey, oh, hey, hey, oh, hey. Congratulations, champion. Make sure you email me just here and I'll get those prizes fair dink and rinky dink straight out to you. Now, if you want to enter into next week's competition, make sure you comment Buffet. below and I'll enter you into next week's competition. Thanks so much for having entered this week. Good luck for everyone who has entered next week for some more awesome one-off prizes. Thanks again. Take care, champion. See you then. Back to Bo. Oh, 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 I've told you it's been an insane week, right? So you're relaxed. You're digesting all that incredible magic because I have a lot more magic dropping over this next week. So sit back, relax, strap yourself in, because let's get into it. Now, tomorrow on Thursday, we have two incredible releases. So let's kick it off with the first one, The Vault. Bro Gilbert, come on in, mate. Come on, come on, come on, mate. Show them what you've got. Are you ready? You know, I've been thinking a lot about Japan lately and a lot about progression. And when you look at skateboarding, you look at guys like Yuto Horigami. Well, I want to tell you about a guy named Sylvester who is a magician from Japan who does the most incredible rubber band magic. He's like the Yuto Horigami of like rubber band magic. This is Sylvester, this is Asteroidia.
Then also on Thursday, George Iglesias and Twister Magic are back with Vending Machine. Let's check out a little snippet of the trailer right now. Hi, I'm George Iglesias. And today I present you the new vending machine, another classic of magic brought to modern times by Twister Magic. Imagine being able to appear any object from a vending machine that was previously selected by a spectator. A great magic apparatus that packs very, very flat and transports easily for your shows and also sets in just seconds. Get ready to create a great magic moment at your show. I absolutely love this modern take on the classic, so if you're gonna see more on Vending Machine, keep it out for the trailer drops tomorrow at 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. It's available for $45, and you need a skill level of a beginner magician to do it. Then jumping into Friday, we have Perspective 2.0 by Julio Montoro. Let's check out the trailer right now. Welcome to Perspective, the second version. In 2021, I released Perspective. It instantly became a bestseller, with more than 2,000 units sold out in just a few days. The internet cracked with clips of magicians performing this on their social media. Today, in 2022, I introduce you the second version of this modern classic, Perspective Volume 2. With this second version, you will rip the perspective of a ripped Monopoly build not only once, but twice. Many people in the original perspective asked me to do a version where you can really tear the paper. With this version, now you can. You are going to receive 20 ready-to-go, specially printed Monopoly bills, so you can rip as many as you want. And this is the best part. An unlimited PDF file where you can print your own Monopoly bills, so you will not need to ever buy any refills at all. I am Julio Montoro and welcome to the best perspective version to date. Now let's take a look at the uncut performance of the second version. This one is gonna sell out fast, so make sure you move quick. Now, if you want to see more on Perspective 2.0, keep it out from the trailer drops on Friday at 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. It'll be available for $24.95, and you need a skill level of a beginner magician to do it. 
Then on Monday, Jordan Victoria is back with Kicker Changing Deck. Let's check out a little snippet of the trailer right now. I've got to be honest, I'm really, really excited for this one, so I can't wait. So if you want to see more on Kicker Changing Deck, keep an eye out for the trailer drops on Monday at 12 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. It's available for $19.95. You need a skill level of a beginner magician to do it. Oh, what a week. I can take a breath now because that was a lot of magic to talk about. So thank you so much for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. And if you're new here, please consider hitting subscribe so you don't miss out on any new magic that drops and you see videos like this that drop every single day. Now, what are you most excited for? Let me know in the comment section below. Let me know what you really, really want to see. And if you have any questions about anything at all, it could be about any of these effects or anything at all, anything you want answered, let me know in the comment section below. Use the hashtag question time so I can find them amongst all the competition entries. Now, I'll let you get back to your Wednesday champion. So thanks again for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. You have an incredible week. I'll see you on Saturday for a Saturday Sorcery, which is a super incredibly visual piece of magic. I'm really excited to show you this one. I'll see you on Discord for our weekly jam, or I'll see you next week on Tuesday for a stumped on, then on Wednesday for another What's New This Week. Now take care, see you later, bye for now. Whoa, look at this. Whoa, so much good magic in there. You, you need to check this out. You're not gonna regret it. I, I, I pinky promise you. Oh, whoa, look at this. This shining diamond over here. What is this? Beautiful. You probably should click that if you haven't subscribed yet. But then you should definitely check out this because this, this is good. Treat yourself.